Evening folks, it's time for another product test and today I'm testing the Willful Fitness Tracker. As you can see, got lots of functions on the side of it. Uh, you can do a heart rate monitor, a step pedometer, you can measure your distance, your calories and it's also got a sedentary alert so you can monitor how long you sleep for etc. Uh, comes in a nice little box as you can see, it's a flip open box. I haven't got my fingers around it. Nice picture of the watch inside, exactly what it does look like actually. Uh, inside is usually the watch, but I've taken it out for the purpose. Anyway, what comes? Da da! One fitness tracker, as you can see. Now, what I like about this fitness tracker is one, it comes with two straps, which is unusual. You don't normally get a spare strap as well, but you have actually got a spare strap. So you've got two straps, that's a good start with. Now, it doesn't come how I've got it there. I'll show you how it does come. Just let me, uh, this is the fiddly bit, but it's not fiddly, but it's only fiddly for me because I haven't got very good fingers. <laughs> Hence the struggle. Now what comes is that. And the strap separate. Now the beauty of this is, I wondered, at first I looked at it and I could, me, my wife looked in the box and couldn't find a charging cable, which was hilarious. And then I realised that what you do, I've just got this for the purpose of showing you. That's a USB hub. You take your smartwatch. You find your copper pins at the bottom and you plug it into your USB. And when you plug it into your USB, it starts charging. It starts charging straight away. Now, the good thing about it is as well, when it's finished charging, it does indicate because it makes a sound and also shows you the full battery on the top of it at the moment. But that's how you do it. All you do is you find any USB port on your computer, your laptop, whatever, and you just plug it in and it starts charging. And then once you've finished... You take your two parts of your strap, two parts of your strap, you fit one end into that side, like this, and you take the other end and put it on like that. That's how easy it is. Now I'll show you how it fits on your watch on your wrist. This is how comfortable it is. It's a really, really nice durable strap. As you can see, I'm gone. As you can see. It fits on your wrist perfectly, you just press the top button there, and it comes up with your time, set your time. Uh, the good thing is, again, like I said, it's nice and comfortable, and it's quite small, so it's not one of them big, bulky, chunky things that's going to get in your way when you're running or jogging or, you know, in day-to-day -day ac uh, activities. When you get this, you basically go on to a thing called Very Fit Pro, which is an app on the uh, any app store ios or android you go onto there you download the app you download the app you set it running and it literally will ask you for your information your height your weight etc etc you can then program it from the uh, app on your phone to tell exactly you want to set how many uh, steps you want to do per day how much running you want to do how much walking you can monitor your heart rate now as soon as you put all your details in that and put the watch on your wrist that app will start synchronizing with the watch uh, with the fitness tracker and you will start noticing that if it says 96 beats per minute on the heart thing it says it on the phone as well it is really really good technology and like i said it's very unobtrusive because it's, it's so snug on your wrist it doesn't stick out or jolt and there's no buttons either side that can get caught on your clothing so it's a really really good fitness tracker and like I said, it, like I said it, look at it, it's nice and simple. Now, I know a lot of these, especially the um, known makes, shall we say, can cost a fortune. This one, believe it or not, was $16.99. That's all it was for a decent fitness tracker. Now, when it's charged, it takes about uh, two, three hours to charge, I think. And when it's on your wrist, it can, it can last hours. It really can last hours because the beauty of it is it does go into standby mode. Now, when I say standby mode, I don't mean that it'll, everything will reset. If you set it to record your beats per, uh, your uh, steps, say you were setting it, I mean, I've got it upside down here. I wonder why it wouldn't come on. If you set it to set your steps, now how you do it is when your icon comes up with the thing, you hold your finger on and it then comes up with, uh, can I see that properly? Uh, yeah, there you go. Whoops, it's gone off again. Hang on, there you go. And it shows you. And on that, you can actually monitor your calories, your minutes that you're walking, etc., etc., and it'll show you exactly how much you're burning off. So if you're, say, training for a race or something, you can get it to do that. Now, the other good thing about this is when you go on the app, at the moment, there's only three or four things on this, which are bike, running, heartbeat, and steps. 
but you can actually put your own on it. So you can go onto the app and say you did a lot of football or yoga. You could put yoga as one of the exercises and it would monitor your heartbeat while you're doing the yoga. So you can actually adjust it and make it compatible with what you want to do. It's not just a set, a set thing. You don't just see like five items and that's it. But yeah, I think it's absolutely fantastic. My wife, we've now got two of these, not two of these. We've got the first one that I did a test for, the smartwatch, which is also a fitness tracker, and this one. So what I'm going to start doing is when I start um, going with my wife to take the dog for a walk, because that's as much exercise as I get, I'm going to start monitoring my steps and my heartbeat and my cows and keep an eye on them. Because I know it's important that I do things like that. Uh, especially at my age um, and I've got to start keeping an eye on things like that now again like I said the beauty is look you see there heartbeat uh, sorry there's walk press it again run press it again bike press it again back to the main screen press it again there's your steps there's your heart monitor and if you hold in I think it's because it didn't on my wrist it doesn't want to do it Oh yeah, there you go. That's my heart rate at the moment, because I just had it on my wrist, didn't I? So as you can see, it's on my heart. There you see, see now. It's changing. Because <laughs> I'm breathing in and out quite quickly. My heart rate's changing, 83 beats per minute, 87. So you can see that it is very, 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 very good accurate. I will say one thing, when you first put it on and you start walking up and down, you'll notice at first it doesn't keep a track of your steps and I thought there was something wrong with it, but it isn't. It just takes a couple of minutes to attune to your pace, your how you walk, and it's got to realise exactly what you call a step. Because obviously different people, if you've got different size, you know, length of legs, and you, some people are tall, some people are short, everybody, <coughs> pardon me, everybody steps different. So it has to attune to your body, and once it attunes to you, it's brilliant. So this is what you get. You get your fitness tracker, you get your smart box, and you get a spare strap. You also get all the instructions in there. And when I say all the instructions, it literally breaks down everything you can do on it. There's even a music mode on there yet, but I haven't actually figured that one out. I think it's to listen to uh, to have music or something playing, but I don't know how that kind of works because there doesn't seem to be a music holder on it. But it's really, really good. It's also got, believe it or not, a message reminder. I didn't realise that. From social media networks. It alerts you the latest information in real time. It's amazing what you can learn, isn't it? Uh, it also automatically tracks your sleep time and consistency. So say you have a night where you have eight hours sleep, great. It'll say fantastic. But if you have a bad night and you only have three hours sleep, this will monitor that and it will alter your patterns to, to, to suit that because it knows that you've had hardly any sleep. So it understands, if you know what I mean. It's technology for you, it's brilliant. Anyway, that's my review for the Willness... Will there, Willness? Willness? No. The Willful Fitness Tracker. Enjoy the mistakes. Bye for now.